Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to apply a freeze frame effect in DaVinci Resolve 16 on an action video clip like this. And freeze. Okay, so welcome to SharingYourPassion.com. I'm Chill and let's get it on. Okay, here we are inside DaVinci Resolve 16 and I have a clip here from our cruise last year and a really amazing um, act. So let me play this for you. I'm going to hit Control F for full screen. This thing is so dangerous. Then we can add our freeze frame somewhere there. Okay. So let's get back to the, the edit mode. Okay, pretty much there's one technique that I use to add freeze frame. And there's three kinds of situations where you can add a freeze frame. It's at the very beginning to extend, say, an introduction um, image. And also at the end if you wanted to add, you know, 5, 10, 15 seconds of a, a freeze frame. And anywhere in between. So that's three. In between, the beginning and the end. This freeze frame is going to be in the middle because he's jumping in mid-air. Let's find a spot for, for the freeze frame. Okay. Okay, let's add the freeze frame here. So what I do is press Control B to cut it, to split it, the clip, into two. Okay, now I can hit the right button to move one frame over. Okay, so that's just one frame. That's the freeze frame we're going to capture. And I press Control B again to cut it. So I have a one frame tiny little video clip right there, which I can't see because I'm too zoomed out. So, so now you have to think how many seconds will this freeze frame last? Well, let's make it for three seconds. So we drag this portion over three seconds. You can see the counter n near the uh, arrow moving. Okay, we got, we have three seconds. Close enough. So this is a three second space. And now let's zoom into that frame. So I'm going to, this is another trick, hit Alt and start scrolling in with your mouse. That means that's a faster way to scroll and zoom in. Okay, now I have to highlight that frame. Right click and change clip speed. And there's a little checkbox here for freeze frame. Change. That pretty much turns this whole section into one image. So now we have an image, it's no longer a video frame. Okay, so now we can drag the right side of this frame, this image now. Get When you get that, left click. Now you can drag it over. I'm going to zoom out so I can continue the uh, dragging. Alt, zoom, I mean, sc scroll out. Okay, now I can drag this all the way over there. Okay, so now I have my freeze frame. So let's play that from here. Let's uh, go full screen. Play. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, so now we have that freeze frame. Okay, let's exit this. So, so the other two scenarios is adding a freeze frame at the end and at the beginning. So it's pretty much the same process. Okay, so let me play the whole thing for you where we've added the freeze frame in the beginning, in the middle, and at the end. Here it goes. Freeze frame here. Here's the mid-air freeze frame. And the freeze frame at the end. Okay. 
I hope you found this useful and if so, please give the video a like. Let me know down in the comment section below if you have other questions that I haven't addressed and I'll certainly get back to you as soon as I can. I'll be doing more videos like this so subscribe and click the notification bell to see those. And remember, it's my mission to give you the tools and inspiration to help you build your online business and transform your passion into success. Thank you.